These films will live on in cinematic history, thanks in part to this man's musical genius. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 Hans Zimmer movie scores. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we'll be looking at the musical scores and movie soundtracks that have been composed or produced at least in part by Hans Zimmer. Number 10. Sherlock Holmes. Your general lack of hygiene or the fact that you steal my clothes. Sherlock Holmes features our favorite London detective attempting to solve a number of murders, but not without Hans Zimmer's intense yet fun-sounding soundtrack. My ten minutes are up. music he composed for the flick has been noted as one of his most experimental yet. It stands out especially because of the unique instruments used, including banjos, violins, a cymbalome, and a broken piano, which gives the film an Eastern European feel. Once these sounds come together, they make for a rousing and entertaining compliment to Sherlock Holmes and his adventures. Watson, what have you done? Number 9. The Thin Red Line This great evil... Where's it come from? This film follows a group of U.S. soldiers battling through World War II, and their fictional yet epic story is told with the help of Tibetan bulls, taiko drums, harps, and a Melanesian choir. Zimmer's score for The Thin Red Line provides a soft, dooming and gloomy atmosphere, and doesn't have the traditional intensity and power of war films. I never felt he hated me, because I don't hate him. Despite this, the score transcends the film, aids in bringing out emotions from the soldiers, and earned an Oscar nod. Number 8. The Prince of Egypt Oh, my son. They were only slaves. A silver screen adaptation of Moses leading his followers out of Egypt, plus the genius of Hans Zimmer, equals a motion picture that will leave you awestruck. With this staff, you shall do my wonders. was partly responsible for the arrangement of the Prince of Egypt soundtrack, which interweaved music from a roster of star-studded acts. Who knows what miracles you can achieve, can achieve when you believe. Which were written by Stephen Schwartz and compositions solely produced by Zimmer. Who are you? I am that I am. Classical instruments, chants, and vocals are at play here, and they match the majestic feel and power this movie brings. Nobody will even notice. <laughs> Number 7. Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End Captain Sparrow finds himself trapped in Davy Jones' locker in this third installment of the Pirates of the Caribbean series. And, of course, Hans Zimmer's music matches the mood.
Apeina. At World's End is set to dark and haunting, yet epic and Philharmonic style music, and is a departure from the lighter, heartier tones of the previous soundtracks in the franchise. They've started to sing. Another reason why fans appreciate the At World's End soundtrack is the fact that it also departs from the more synthetic style of the first few soundtracks and feels more like a thrilling sea adventure. The wind's on our side, boys! That's all we need! <laughs> Number 6. The Last Samurai. Samurai, come. You'll be fine, son. For the soundtrack of The Last Samurai, a film that has Tom Cruise battling 19th century samurai warriors in Japan, Zimmer makes use of Japanese instrumentation, including flutes and taiko drums. Zimmer gets points for crafting a soundtrack that stays true to his nature of rousing, intense scores, while also perfectly encapsulating Japanese influences. Dead to the last man. This is one of Zimmer's more majestic sounding bodies of work, and is at its best in scenes with high tension and drama. You have your honor again. Let me die with mine. Number 5. The Dark Knight. This superhero film is mostly remembered for the legendary performance that Heath Ledger put on as the Joker, as he terrorized citizens and battled Batman and District Attorney Harvey Dent. But when I say that one little old mayor will die, well then everyone loses their minds! But one huge reason why The Dark Knight as a whole was such an outstanding film was its dark, booming score, complete with electronic and orchestral influences. I have to say that as a result, the score is a more powerful and ominous soundtrack in comparison with its predecessor, Batman Begins. I never said thank you. And you'll never have to. Which Zimmer also composed, though both are memorable in their own right. Simon Guardian, a watchful protector, a dark knight. Number four, The Lion King. Simba, let me tell you something that my father told me. The music for The Lion King is a magical ride from the start, accompanying young lion Simba, who is destined to follow in the footsteps of his father Mufasa and his journey through life. While superstar Elton John and lyricist Tim Rice wrote the songs, Zimmer added a philharmonic touch with African influences, including chants and percussion to the score. The Lion King soundtrack went on to become the best-selling animated film soundtrack in the US, while Zimmer won an Oscar, a Golden Globe, and two Grammy Awards for his work. Simba, it's to die for. Number 3. Gladiator The Gladiator soundtrack will go down as one of, if not the best, of Zimmer's finest in terms of epic film scores. Roman General Maximus seeks to avenge his slaughtered family by fighting in the Colosseum. His story goes hand in hand with the dramatic and pulsating string instruments of the movie score. You do have a name. My name is Gladiator. If nothing else, they're perfect anthems to hear before stepping into the ring.
Though the music might sometimes seem over the top, it's way more powerful and booming than some of Zimmer's previous work, and certainly matches the epic feel needed for a movie like Gladiator. Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here? Number two, Inception. What is the most resilient parasite? Bacteria? A virus? Inception was already a brilliant film because of its acting, cinematography, and its complex yet intriguing concept where a man tries to do the impossible and put an idea in another one's mind. Inception. Is it possible? Of course not. But Zimmer's score enhanced the sci-fi tenfold. His use of synthesizers with blaring orchestral sounds added to the death-defying fight scenes and car chases. Then there was music added to the pivotal final shot of Dom's totem, spinning and making everyone wonder, is Dom dreaming or is he in reality? It certainly wouldn't have been the same without it. Before we unveil our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. You're my best friend. Daddy, wait! Solomon. <laughs> number one, Interstellar. Our number one selection is the third film on this list to be directed by Christopher Nolan. This adventure follows astronauts who are looking for a new home for humans after discovering a wormhole. Mankind was born on Earth was never meant to die here. Trading in his usual orchestral and rousing sound for an atmospheric yet emotionally impactful soundtrack. Don't make me leave like this, Murph. Zimmer's score for the epic sci-fi evokes power and drama from its slowly building pipe organ chords. Zimmer was asked to make music without knowing much, if anything, about the movie, and still managed to create one of the most impressive scores he's ever produced. Do not go gentle into that good night. Old age should burn and rave at close of day. Rage, rage against the dying of the light. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.